New details tonight on an East Bay firefighter who was bit in the face by a pit bull. This evening, we're learning Battalion Chief John Whiting is doing all right, surrounded by family. He's being treated at Stanford Medical Center. Kit Doe has the story. We're told that Chief Whiting is now awake but medicated. He is in stable condition and surrounded by his family. They've convened a team of surgeons to go over his next options. Whiting suffered extensive facial injuries and has undergone at least one operation, but likely faces several more. The battalion chief was responding to a fire at a house in unincorporated San Leandro yesterday. A 15-year-old girl was holding this pit bull, which was on a leash, when it lunged and bit Whiting on the left cheek. Whiting even asked if the dog was secure before a approaching, but the girl was unable to hold the dog back. Whiting initially went to Eden Hospital, but was transferred to Stanford Healthcare in Palo Alto. And it's no wonder Stanford is home to some of the best reconstructive surgeons in the country. Back in 2011, a small army of doctors made international news after separating a pair of conjoined twins. As for the pit bull, it's been placed in quarantine. There were about 20 dogs living in the house at the time, and so Alameda County Sheriff's deputies are investigating possible criminal neglect. And the fire department says the family doesn't need anything for now. No word on any kind of GoFundMe account that's been set up just yet. But as soon as they do, we'll let you know. In Palo Alto, Kitto, KPIX5.